Hi, my name is Jose Luis. Hi, my name is Sarai Lopez. My name is Alfredo. I'm the sample maker. And now sewing seamstress in Indie Source. I'm working here in India Source. I am sample maker. I try to help to everyone, I like uh, pattern makers, and production managers, sewers too, for do better stuff. How long have you been sewing? How long have you been doing this? Well, I started when I was 12 years, it's about 45 years. When did you first start sewing? When did you start? Ooh, <laughs> okay, I like it to sew size I was six or seven years old. I'm sewing like more than 30 years. Or where, where did you first start working? No, I worked for a factory over there in Mexico. So then later I opened my factory over there. Why did you choose sewing? Well, I, I, and the sewing is in my family. My father was tailoring and he teach all his boys to sewing. And I love sewing because I like uh, transforming the fabric and garments for the people. I like it well, over here, yeah. Especially with the owners, they are very nice, so I work in good right here. Like this company is a nice place to work. I love it, my work. So when you were younger and you were starting out, what did you sew? Any um, sport, clothing sport. I sew in everything. I sew in blouses, dresses. Baby blankets. And then in everything. You just Every, love everything. Yes, okay. everything. Sometimes I work with the designers to help them. Well, how is the best stitch for different fabric? Or how is the best lining or the, the sewing constru construction? Because it's very important to get the uh, fabric correct for the uh, good constructions. It's important. Um, the pieces is uh, perfect. The sewing is perfect. Is there any advice that you would give designers when they're thinking about how to build their collections? Always uh, find the best. Mm -hmm. No, never, never say no can. What makes us different from other manufacturers is all of our seamstresses are in-house along with our pattern makers so we have easy access to communicate with them. This is a constant, all these moving parts always happen in the industry of design and manufacturing so it's nice if something changes or something happens I can go and just easily go next door and talk and communicate. You don't have to send an email or leave a message. So it's immediate. Um, so the project manager and the sample maker, the way we work together here is um, I fill out a cut ticket which tells the sample maker uh, which fabric to use for the self fabric, which is the majority of the garment. And then if there's a contrast fabric, um, I also put that on the cut ticket. So it's a little bit of a a language that we all understand just by filling out this one form. I send it to go be cut and they with the pattern and the fabric that they're supposed to use. The cutter will cut the pattern and the fabric I give them um, and then they hand it to the sewer. Sometimes uh, we help to the pattern makers because sometimes little things is not right but we talk with the pattern maker and they fix it and so I like to do that with work with the pattern maker, designer. You said that you went to pattern making school. Mm -hmm. How did that help you as a sample maker? I went to pattern maker school because I wanted to learn how they made the pattern through the computer because before we made by hand and they have all the only instruction in the pattern and it's more easy for doing the patterns. I need to know how this the process is starting to make the pattern, go to the computer and go to the printer. That helped me a lot for understand how the styles come in or how the designer wants to do in the uh, parents. I'd like to see you here in India Source and thank you for the interview. Bye. Bye.